Baby, you could keep me going Cause you've been everywhere Let me take up all the love you're showing I need it more than air What's up you guys? This is future Rashi checking in. So while I was editing this video, I realized that I did not give y'all any context as to where I am, what I'm doing, how I got here, um, any of those details. So for those of you that are new here and those of you that do not follow me on Instagram, y'all probably are wondering where I am and how I'm in Canada suddenly. Um, if you want more updates on what I'm doing, um, constantly follow me on my Instagram. I'll leave it like linked right here and in the description box down below. So do follow me there. So you'll be way more updated with uh, what I'm doing. And my Instagram's kind of cute. So follow me. I'm in Canada. I'm in Toronto. Um, I got here on the 27th night from India. So I had a layover um, India to London, London to Toronto. Um, and I got here on the 27th night. I'm currently staying with my aunt and uncle all the way in Markham City, um, which is about an hour and a half away from downtown Toronto for anybody that's familiar with the area. Uh, my aunt and uncle are currently away. They're in New York for the weekend. So I'm house sitting for them as well. I'm currently in the kitchen. It's about nine, it's about 10 o'clock and I've just woken up and come downstairs to make some breakfast. But little context as to what I'm doing in Canada. I'm here to study. I go to college in Canada. Um, I'm starting on the, on Thursday, so I'm starting this fall at the George Brown College. And for all of y'all that are asking me what I do and what I'm studying and what my course is, I am a like a culinary student, and I'm doing baking and pastry arts management at the George Brown College. Uh, my orientation was on the 29th. Super exciting! I'll insert some clips right here from orientation. <laughs> So we're done watching those clips from orientation i did not film much i'm sorry but that's what my orientation looked like um i've been just chilling the past few days since this is rashi from the future um yesterday was a really fun day i'm gonna give you all a little context as to what i did yesterday before i insert all the clips from yesterday so like stay stay tuned to watch the clips i'm just gonna rant for a bit and then insert all the clips so y'all will understand what i'm doing because i realize the clips are a little haphazard so yeah yesterday was the 31st it was a saturday and i took a a go train downtown and uh, met up with a friend who goes to university of toronto and i actually know her from back home in india um she's my friend from bangalore so we met up uh chill for a bit at downtown and then we took a lift and went to uh, the CNEs. CNEs are basically the Canada National Exhibition or the Canadian National Exhibition, I'm not too sure. But it's a huge fair, um, like a summer uh, fair slash uh, carnival that happens once a year from like from the end of September, from the end of August to the first week of first week of september so i think it's a three weekend long carnival that they put up and it's basically a really big deal in canada everybody um uh, goes to this um it's like tradition to go to the cnes so the minute i got here everyone was like you have to do the cnes you cannot miss out on the cnes so I was initially supposed to go to the CNEs today, but my plans changed up a little bit and I ended up going yesterday, which was a Saturday. So I'm just going to insert all the clips from yesterday and then I'm going to meet y'all once y'all are done watching those clips and then I'll explain the rest of the You know that I've been suffocating, you could be the one to help, but my issues are nauseating, I don't want to bring you down. I just want to be free from the free and feel love for the first time I just want to love something about me See something to open my eyes Don't want to be the only one with the house key Have something I'm proud of I wish 
I just got off my bus and I'm in downtown. I'm actually at Union Station and I'm waiting for a friend to come get here. She's running a little late, but it's fine. For now, I'm gonna be downtown, probably walking around, um, doing some exploring. I feel like little Dora the Explorer with my little backpack on. 20 minutes later and I'm still right here eating my apples. One thing I learned in Canada is always carry a snack wherever you go because you don't know when you're going to get hungry. So I'm really glad I got this apple. I'm going to sit here, eat my apple and wait for Neta. Hopefully she gets here soon. Yeah, I'm not complaining. It's a beautiful view, you guys. Okay, so now that you're done watching all the clips from the CNEs, I apologize. I did not film too much of the CNEs just because my phone battery was running out of charge. And like an idiot, I forgot to charge my power bank, uh, which is my, my fault. But um, yeah, that's basically what it was. It, it was basically a huge area full of rides in food stalls and... Um, like games and all of this really fun stuff it's like a proper carnival it's everything and more that you see in the movies and that you expect from a carnival i wanted to like come back home um early so we stayed till about 7 15 i actually did catch the 7 15 uh go train back to union station from where i was and then got off at the union station and uh ended up taking um a go bus all the way back to Markham. I reached, I think, the GO station at Markham at around 9, 9.30. I took a lift from the GO station in Markham to uh, back home. It's about 10.08 right now. I've just woken up and come down to the kitchen to make myself some breakfast. My aunt and uncle are away, so I'm going to make myself some breakfast. And then... Um, I don't know what the plan for the day is. I actually have to go to Mississauga today in the evening um, just to meet a bunch of my friends from back home. They go to the University of Toronto in Mississauga. So I think I'm going there in the evening and I'm probably staying over at a friend's place in Mississauga um, tonight. So during the day, I don't think I'm doing much. I'm probably just going to get breakfast now, chill around for a bit. I have a few like things to get done on my laptop i need to sign my lease agreement so i'm probably gonna sit here with my breakfast and finish doing that just want to say i am super grateful um to be here and to be experiencing all of this it's just i have to pinch myself every two seconds to just like be like this is real you've made it um it's been it's been months and months of work to get here so finally being here is like a huge rock lifter off my shoulder <laughs> fun adulting i did go to the bank alone i did go um get a few of my government issue documents done alone but yeah that's that's been fun so now i'm just gonna make some breakfast insert some cute montages and then um see you all along the way I'm having a piece of toast with some fruits and my lemon water and some honey on my toast. What do you think about my breakfast, Baba? Good girl. Good girl. I miss South Indian breakfast already. Well, I, I got South Indian breakfast like two days ago. My aunt made me dosa, but 
Hmm, this is what breakfast from now on will look like. And this is what my breakfast view will look like. What's up you guys? So I just finished getting ready. I had a shower, washed my hair, um, put on this outfit. I'm wearing my Air Force Ones and my ripped high-waisted shorts and my GBC sweatshirt repping already so i'm gonna head on out and i'll update y'all when i'm on my way so i just got off the go bus and i'm in downtown now and i'm waiting for a lift to come pick me up So I just got off my lift and I'm somewhere near my residence but I can't seem to find it. guys it's <coughs> oh my god i'm so exhausted i'm eating some cotton candy that i got at the cnes um the other day and it's still so nice i'm fluffy it's really strange because it's not like the cotton candy we get back in india anyways so yesterday um was a really fun day i actually went and signed my lease as you saw um went and looked at my room it's super cute i'm super excited to meet uh my roommates uh, i haven't met them yet so i'm super excited to see who i'm sharing the space with i uh, went inside my lease so yeah i finally have got that done uh we're almost at the finishing line which i'm so happy about uh after which i headed down to mississauga to the utm campus to see some of my friends back from india who go to UTM um, and they actually have that frosh week going on and one of my friend is a frosh leader so um, since I got there early I got to go to like a cheer off that they had happening for like for their frosh and it was so much fun it was like the whole uni experience that I don't get to have because I go to a college I don't go to university so things work a little more differently there uh, plus, I go to culinary school, so it's a lot different from how a typical American slash Canadian university is. So, super nice, got the whole university experience yesterday, after which um, I think the cheer off got over by like 9.30 or so. And then uh, we headed back to my friend's residence and we chilled there for a bit. And then we actually went to the club last night. Uh, we went to two clubs in downtown. It was super fun. And I think we left the club around 2.33 in the morning. And uh, we Ubered back to Mississauga and went to a friend's place and then crashed there. It's about 4.30 right now. And I'm chilling at home. I just quickly ate um a snack and now i'm eating my cotton candy i'm chilling here watching some youtube i have to actually respond to some mails i look at some college um assignment outlines that they've sent in and i have to study for a test that i have to take on thursday which i want to get out of the way right now because um i might be moving in during the week i might be moving in tomorrow i'm not really sure so i don't want to leave my test studying for the last minute so i'm going to finish that now my uncle and aunt are actually coming back um from new york this evening let's go pick some strawberries strawberry planters in her backyard and I actually see one um two three and four strawberries so i'm gonna like try to do this with one hand but i 
literally sat here trying to unlock the stupid shit for half an hour and i looked up like four youtube videos didn't happen Haley had to come unlock it for me so thanks Haley. saved my life i'm just sitting on the ground for half an hour so i just finished college and i'm at this place called canadian tile we had to pick up a bunch of that stuff, so my um, lecturer actually told me to get a bunch of things. I had to get a weighing scale, um, scotch tape, all that boring stuff, a file, some binder, really boring things. I'm actually here with one of my friends, Sanjana. I'm going to introduce you all to her in a bit, but I'm kind of lost. I'm just going to finish up shopping and then I'll update you all in a bit. Hi. <laughs> no, you do it. There's this place called Pizza Pizza. We're getting pizza. Oh, my friend's son. No. It's just zoomed into your face. <laughs> The video was a rough dress, so I was like, okay. <laughs> Thank you. No problem. Do I look cute? You look really cute. Okay, <laughs> What's up you guys? I'm finally checking in. I'm sorry I haven't had time the whole day. So I basically had to take a placement test in the morning and that went on from 9 to 12 and then I had a two hour break where I headed back to my apartment to go check it out and pick up my keys. I finally got my apartment keys so yeah, picked that up. I had to head back downtown so I took a bus, came back downtown um i had another class i had a math class for about an hour so i took that math class after math class i gave my friend a call and she was near college too we went to this place called the george diner and it's right around the corner from where my college is it was super cute super good food i'm stuffed it's about 4 30 right now and i have a lab class at um at six so i'm just gonna like hang around college for a bit and then I'm gonna go for my class. Oh my gosh, I just put on my uniform for the first time. That's my chef's coat and my pants are like striped. But yeah, it's about 5.30 and that's my Tropicana. I'm going to drink that at class. But yeah, it's 5.30 and I have to head down in about 10 minutes because we're supposed to be 20 minutes earlier than our class whenever we have practicals to do like mise en place and just some prep. It has a really cute like, that's my name tag and that's the symbol. Super cute. I look like Ratatouille. I have to put on my hat in a bit, which I'm not gonna do now. I'm gonna put it on later, but y'all will never see that because I feel like I look like Ratatouille. But got a little snack at the grocery store, like thing that we have on campus. I got a Tropicana and 
I got Sour Patch Kids. This is a cherry blaster. I haven't tried this yet, so let's go sit down and like do a taste test. I still have some time. I'm actually waiting for a friend to get here. So till she gets here, we have time. Let's go try this. JVC security learning how to unlock my lock. 32, 32. That's not 32. This is 32. Okay. Hold on. Yeah, there you go. Now you know. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. I'm finally vlogging in the morning. I to leave now to go to the station to catch my bus. I think I'm taking a bus or a train. I'm not sure. I have to go there and check. But I have to leave in about 10 15 minutes. I'm waiting for my aunt to drop me. Um, today's day is pretty chilled out. I only have one class, and that's my general elective class. And I've taken pop culture as my general elective. So it's going to be so much fun. I've heard like really good reviews about the professor. So I'm really excited to meet my prof and like see the class. Um, I made an effort to look cute today because it's a general elective class and it's going to be a lot of people and it's going to be like a bigger haul. Today I forgot to end the vlog um, for the day, but I just ended up taking a train and coming back home. And then my aunt picked me up from the station and I came, took a long hot shower and then ended up like passing out immediately because I was so tired. Uh, yesterday was a really long day. I had lab till 11 o'clock. So that was, wasn't too much fun. But yeah, today is very chill. I just have one class 12 to 3. And then I think I'm going to head back because I'm actually moving into my house um, over this weekend. So I'm moving in Saturday. So I need to come back and repack all my things. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna head out now and get my things and we're gonna get to college. Okay, so I just got into my room and I'm not gonna show y'all. I want to, I really wanna show you in this video, but then I thought I'd make a separate video and that'll be cuter where I'll do like a whole moving in vlog and then I'll also film a room tour video like once I am done because I've been getting that a lot like when I was in India. I just stopped by. I'm gonna be here for a couple of hours. I'm gonna sit here, probably study for a bit, get that out of the way. Um, I want to take measurements of like some parts of the room because I want to buy some like furniture and like decor so I'm just gonna do that take some pictures plan out where I want to put what to get like a rough idea of what I want to do yeah so I'm gonna like be here for a few hours get all of that work out of the way uh I'm here for a few hours because I'm actually meeting my friend Netra who I went to the CNE is with uh and we're going to a frat party so basically my college GBC does not have frats and sororities but UT that's University of Toronto has one so I'm going to a that um at utdt which is like the downtown campus i'm not too sure um yeah i'm just chilling out i'll update y'all in a bit but, but i was still standing it's in the jesus i will like documenting this yes so nathan and me are going to our first frat party i don't know how to feel honestly. and we've been walking around the block trying to avoid it <laughs> but now we're gonna do it <laughs> let's go <laughs> Rashi from the future again I was editing the vlog that you're just watching and I realized as usual I forgot to end my vlog so I thought I'd just come on in and end the vlog after the frat party I did just end up um, going back to Markham and then moving in the next day I actually had a test to take the next day never go to a frat party 
when you have a test the next day life advice coming back downtown the next day taking my test and uh moving into my new place you can see a part of it right now i'm not going to give away too much but yeah i did just end up moving in the next day that's going to be on the next vlog i actually did film the whole moving in i have a moving in vlog coming up very soon so stay tuned for that i really 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 hope you enjoyed this video this is one of my first videos from canada and i'm so excited excited to be making content here and just um it's a series of like new life experiences and it's just been the craziest and the most humbling past few weeks for me uh but yeah i'm just really glad that i get to take you all along this whole process and document it and uh essentially show you all what my life looks like i really hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up if you did comment down below any other future video ideas that you all have again i am an international student in canada if you want me to make more like student related question answer kind of videos where i answer some of your questions please leave them in the comments down below Um but yeah if there's any other kind of video that you want me to film and then don't forget to subscribe to my channel and um don't forget to switch on the bell icon I basically just wanted to say thank you so much to all of you guys that have sent me really sweet DMs and that just have been like so positive and so nice I cannot believe this is actually my life right now I'm going to stop ranting I really hope you enjoyed this video I'm going to be making way more content in the coming week so yeah stay tuned for this new adventure it's a new chapter in my life and i'm really glad that i get to take y'all along with me and uh, in the process help out anybody that has questions or queries about what an international student's life in canada looks like but yeah it's a whole new chapter in my life i'm so excited for this a new journey and everything that it's going to bring the past few weeks have been the most amazing past few weeks of my life i've lived and learned so much about myself that i haven't in the past 18 years i'm just so excited this just editing this just made me so happy because it just looked like such a wholesome week that's it for this video i'm going to see y'all in my next video until then keep on watching